Hi, my name is Alan Rabinowitz. I am one of the owners of Rainbow Recovery. I'm Tracy Weimer. I'm a counselor here at Rainbow Recovery Center. Um, I'm also the outreach coordinator. Um, Rainbow Recovery was opened in 2008, um, pretty much in the height of the opioid crisis. I worked for the Mercer County Coroner's Office for years, starting in 1999, um, right when opioids hit pretty much in Pennsylvania. We decided, myself and my partners, that we wanted to help. And the best way I saw fit was to open up a medication-assisted treatment facility um, here in Mercer. The, the biggest obstacle to treatment, my opinion and our facility's opinion, is getting people through the door started in treatment. What sets our clinic aside from other clinics is that we are small. We keep an open door policy. So, you know, if we're not in sessions, we always make sure the door is open for any time that the patients may need to come in and speak with us or need anything. Um, another thing that sets us apart is that we have worked very hard over the last few years to um, cut out the stigma of methadone maintenance treatment. Um, that's been a really difficult thing to do in the community and we are making great strides in it. More people are educated on medication assisted treatment than they were 10 years ago. There's still a stigma attached to it. Um, we'd like to actually break down those barriers and let people know that you know this addiction can hit anybody. It could hit um, lower income families, it could hit high income families. It has no boundaries. People are starting to understand methadone maintenance better than maybe they used to in the past um, and other facilities are more open to working with us. Every patient gets individual counseling but they also we offer a wide variety of groups to take part in. Um, we also offer an enhanced outpatient program which is something that is not offered by any other clinic in the area. People who are struggling can get additional counseling weekly in addition to what they're already getting. We all know everybody by name. I mean, it, it's really, patients come in, it's not like they're just a number. Because we're so small, we're able to give them individual attention, both, you know, our own patients and if a, if a counselor is busy and their patient needs something and our door is open, they'll come to us. My name's Amber. I chose Rainbow because I heard good things about it and it was a smaller clinic. I've had the same counselor the whole time I've been here. They know you, they know your name, they remember what you talked about in your last session and it's not, you're not just a number. Hi, my name is TJ. So Rainbow Recovery, uh, is a lot different because the nursing staff, the counselors, they actually take time to get to know you. You're not just a number. They show a lot of care, compassion. They really care about your recovery. My name is Megan. Um, I have been coming to Rainbow Recovery for um, almost five years now. Rainbow Recovery is different to me because it allowed me to be held accountable for my actions, whether they were positive or negative, but still give me, um, you know, the leeway and accountability. I needed somebody to, to call me on my mistakes and help guide me, but also, you know, to be there to encourage me when I was doing well. And a lot of places focus um, more on just getting people in and out and a little less on the person being a person and you get a lot more of that here. To anybody who sees this, I know what you're going through and it there is a better way. You just got to ask for help and you, you got to be ready to. You have to be ready um, and willing to change everything. It's kind of like you, you try to hide the fact that you're in recovery from people that aren't in recovery. So I was concerned about who would see this video and how they would think, what they would think of me. And I had to just kind of get over that because at the end of the day, there could be somebody out there suffering uh, that might see this video and it might help them. And at the end of the day, it's not about me or what other people think. I wanted to be a part of this project because I know that it's gonna help people. 
Addiction is, it's, it's horrible, but it is not the end all. And you can overcome addiction. Recovery is a gift and it is worth every, every ounce of effort you put into it.